Okay. Um, I just want to make this a quick one. I just want to quickly explain what was in my mind because it just seems to be way better than a status is just to try to speak and get this out there and try to explain exactly what I'm talking about uh, without having to try to get your attention by a text. I've already wasted so much time. It's been 20 seconds. So I want to explain to you why I believe enlightenment is love uh, and the reason why that is so is because once you realize exactly what you are, the universe, everything, every little thing, every big thing, other planets, other stars, every other person, you're just experiencing yourself in subjective views because you're so beautiful and you're just fractaling out and experiencing yourself. And once you understand the unified source field and, and that, that we all are one, you can't help but love yourself. I mean, just think about it. You're looking out and you're seeing all those stars, that's you. You know, you see all these crazy people or beautiful people or whatever. Those people are you. And that's and it's a great way to to deal with their the behavior you don't agree with. Is to try to find a way to perceive that they're just another part of you that's lost. And uh you know, in order to be infinity you have to be lots of things. So when you look out into the universe, you know, the signs are everywhere. Especially when you look up and you see yourself forever away in billions of galaxies. And if, if you can't love yourself after seeing that, how vast and infinite and beautiful and amazing and all different colors and spectrums and dimensions and densities, then, then you're not enlightened. So that's why I sort of... Uh, enlightenment is love and love is enlightenment so I hope you agree